figured as much. Good evening. I'd like to call to order the uh, budget public hearing final budget, September 8th, 2020. Uh, board members, we are socially distanced, so feel free to take your mask off during the meeting if you so choose. The roll call order for tonight will be Member Krause, Vice Chair Pennock, Member Calderon, Member Sanchez, and then myself. Let the record reflect that all school board members, school board attorney, superintendent, and school board clerk are in attendance. Is there a motion to approve the agenda outline? Thank you. Is there a second? Second. Any discussion? All in favor by, signify by saying aye. 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 Any opposed? Motion carries. Thank you. Good evening. Dr. Griffin, I'll turn it over to you. We have our co-CFOs here um, to give us a presentation. And before we start, I want to thank you for getting this budget accomplished. I know it's, it's a long process, and this certainly is not the first time the board is seeing it. Um, but I, I publicly want to thank the two of you. I know it's hours and hours to get this done, and your teams, of course. Matan, go ahead. Yeah, good, good evening, board. I'm joined by um, my colleague here, Ch Kerry Chambers. Uh, tonight's public hearing on the annual budget will include an overview Regarding the proposed uh, millage and budget, there will be an opportunity for public and board member comment. We will request that you adopt a resolution setting the proposed total millage levy to support the 2021 annual budget. We also request that you adopt the resolution approving the 2021 annual budget as presented. The total proposed millage related to school funding for the 2021 school year is 5.934 mills. The millage would generate revenue for the general operating and capital outlay funds. The millage rates are determined by the Florida legislature, and this is the maximum millage that the school board is allowed to levy without a specific voter approved referendum. The district must levy the required local effort and the prior period funding adjustment to, to receive approximately 260.9 million in state FEFP funding. In addition, we must levy the full basic discretionary millage to receive 9.7 million in compression, in compression funding from the state. The proposed total millage rate related to school funding of 5.934 mills represents a decrease of 0 0.199 mills when compared to the 2019-20 year. This slide compares the proposed millage rates to the rollback rates. The current state law rollback rate is 3.7056 mills. The current proposed state law millage rate for 2021 school year is 3.686 mills. The proposed rate is 0.53% less than the rollback rate. The rollback rate for the total millage is 5.8498 mills. The proposed total millage rate is 5.934 mills. The proposed total rate is 1.44% greater than the rollback rate. The district's total budget and summary form is presented for you on the board. The total general fund is the main fund from which most operating expenditures are paid in addition to tonight, you'll be approving budgets for the debt service fund, which is used to pay for the outstanding bonds of the district, the capital project fund, which accounts for the major construction and renovation of projects, the special revenue fund, which consists of food service, AKA Red Apple Dining, and federal grants, and internal service fund, with, which accounts for the district's health insurance, property casualty, workers' compensation, print shop and internal leasing program. The total budget is $1,045,788,869. Madam Chair, this is the time for public comment. Thank you. Um, Ms. Bramus, do you have any public comment? No, ma'am, we have not. Okay, thank you very much. Board members, do you have any questions or comments? Uh, Member Kraus? I, I did not. Thank you. Vice Chair Pennock. Uh, no questions. Thank you again to you and your entire staff for all that you've done to make this um, as successful as we can. Thank you. Member Calderon. 
No additional comments, but Carrie and Todd, just want to thank you for your tenacity in working this budget. We know we got the numbers very late from Tallahassee, but you made all of our deadlines, and we appreciate that. <coughs> Member Sanchez. Thank you also for everything you guys have been doing. It's amazing. And I just wanted to clarify that, like, the funds in the 100 range are all calculated together as well as um, debt services and so on and so forth. Correct? Yes. Okay. Thank you. Thank you, Todd and Carrie, for your uh, efforts. You work really hard. And we appreciate you very much. I know your work's not done because I know Tallahassee could potentially come up with some budget cuts in coming months, so you're probably prepping for that as well. That's we appreciate that. Okay, hey, Dr. Griffin, do you have a recommendation, please? Yes, I do, Madam Chair. My first recommendation is that the School Board of Seminole County adopt resolution number 2020-03, determining revenues and millages levied. Thank you. Is there a motion? So moved. Thank you. Is there a second? I'll second. Okay. Thank, Thank you. Us. Any discussion? All in favor signify by saying aye. 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 Any opposed? Motion passes. Thank you. Dr. Griffin, do you have another recommendation, please? Yes, I do, Madam Chair, that the School Board of Seminole County adopt resolution number 2020-04, adopting the final budget for fiscal year 2020-2021. Thank you. Is there a motion to approve? Motion. Second. Second. Any discussion? All in favor signify by saying aye. 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 Any opposed? Motion carries. Thank you. Seeing no further business, this meeting is adjourned. Thank you.